yes guys, it is Friday again. This week has gone so quick and you know what that means. It's Friday night, wild camping. Will you take part in my life, my love, that is my dream. Now today, now today guys, it's not crazy raining. We have no storm to contend with today, which is nice. Now I've decided today I wanted a bit more of an open night underneath the stars. So we're in the hammock again, but there is still potentially some showers on the way tonight. So as I don't have a tarp, what I'm going to attempt to do is sleep in the Alp kit hunker bivy inside the hammock. I don't know how well that will be and how comfortable it will be, but we're going to give it a go. Um, we're going to go find somewhere sort of in the distance right over there. But before I go and find that, I've just stopped here and I've noticed something pretty cool. And I'm thinking, not this week, but maybe like, maybe next week or sometime soon on one of these Friday trips, we should maybe camp in one of these. Some really cool little shelters here. I mean, this would be, this would actually be pretty cool to maybe build up a bit and uh, sleep in one night, maybe. But not tonight, but what do you reckon? Hit a, if you want to see me like wild camping in somebody else's shelter, hit that like button and we'll do it. And it could be fun or scary, who knows. Right, I'm going to stop waffling on. I'm going to go find where we're going to camp tonight and let's do it. <laughs> Okay guys, I think this is the perfect, perfect spot. It's getting a bit windy, but the sky is starting to like clear up now. There's no rain or anything. So fingers crossed throughout the night we won't get any. I think this is going to be where I set up the hammock between these two trees here. Um, the wind is coming from that way. So this tree should give me a bit of a buffer from the wind. It's not too windy in this little wooded section and it's very peaceful. So let's set up this camp guys. <laughs> that um, the trees weren't far enough apart. Uh, so let's hope these two trees are far enough apart. Right, let's start that time lapse again. <laughs> Right, so hammock is set up above me there. Got a nice little uh, log here to sit on, which is pretty nice. Um, I ended up going to the little of the tree because it still wasn't far enough. I forget how long this hammock is. Um, put it quite high actually tonight, so could should be a bit more flatter than it was last time. Hopefully it'll be comfortable. So Friday night, we come camping and every Friday night we get a meal deal. So it's meal deal time. What they actually didn't have much in today, so I was pretty bummed about that. But for the main, we have got a chicken and smoked bacon roll thing, um, which is spilling everywhere. Lovely. For the drink, we've gone fudge, fudge brownie milkshake. Yes, we've gone for a milkshake today. Super unhealthy. And for the snack, I've gone for a brioche waffle. Now, these would be better to sort of warm up, but they're still good when they're cold and they're very good. And I will say, these are very good when you're cycling and you need a quick pick me up. 
week I splashed out an extra pound today and we got a little bedtime snack for under the stars. We got some fruit pastels. Oh yeah. So, so we have also brought the smallest um, gas stove of Amazon again. This time I am not going to have that coffee before bed. I'm going to have it when I wake up because I don't think tonight is going to rain and I won't be in a rush to get out. So we can chill in the morning and have a nice coffee. Peace. This week, as I said, hammock, and then we're doing something a bit, which is not really a done thing, I don't think, is a bivy inside the hammock, because I don't have any underquilts, and I don't have a tarp. Although it doesn't look like it's gonna rain now, this is England, and it said it potentially could, uh, there could potentially be some showers. So I'm gonna to attempt to get in the bivy in the hammock, just so I can keep the sleeping bag dry. It's not gonna to be too cold tonight, although, it's a little bit chilly now. It's probably going to be like 12 degrees at night, I think. I will let you know how sleeping in a bivy in a hammock goes, because the hardest part is actually going to be able to get into it. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes, and I'll, I'll keep you updated. Um, so where I'm camping tonight, I actually, I actually wanted to get over to that woods just over there but it's like a moat and all this is like moss, like just flooded where it's rained so much and I couldn't get there so it's like a it's like an island that I just can't reach maybe next time maybe because it looks pretty pretty nice over there but my little island's pretty good too I've got a moat so it's all good should be safe from the cows and the horses tonight right I'm gonna get in this hammock and see if I can get in this bivy as well. <laughs> I, uh, right, so guys, um, I've changed the location again. Still in the same place, but just just two different trees. And um, yeah, just over there was the last couple where I was, it was just a little bit too windy. So this place, just, just sort of out of the wind a little bit more and should be a little bit more warmer in the night and a bit quieter. So I'm going to try and get into this bivy and sleeping bag and let's do it. Hey right guys, so I managed to get in the bivy, in the hammock, in the sleeping bag. Yeah, it was a, a little bit of a hassle, but once I'm in, I'm in. Obviously, hopefully I don't need to get up and go to the toilet in the night because uh, it might be quite hard to get out. But yeah, it's, um, it's working right now and I'm comfortable. Night should be pretty calm night it's looking blue skies still and nice and sunny so hopefully no little rain showers but if it does then at least the uh, sleeping bag will stay dry and hopefully there won't be a big puddle in here as there was last week so i'm gonna just like have some snacks i've got some snacks up here chill swinging in my hammock and then Wait till the sun starts setting, which should be in about half an hour, 40 minutes, and then just have a nice early night, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Coffee in the morning. <laughs>
Good morning guys. Last night it got bloody cold. Whoa. I think it got down to about three degrees. And I mean I was pretty warm apart from my feet. Um and all and I probably slept. I think I slept okay. I slept maybe like three or well maybe like four hours. So not too bad. Um but yeah, my feet were absolutely freezing. I'm cold now. Because I just got out of the sleeping bag. Ugh, it's cold. Um, so the plan was this morning to make a coffee. And it would have been really, really nice right now to have some heat. Um, but I seem to have forgotten to bring the lighter. And I don't feel like rubbing two sticks together. So... That's the end of this video. <laughs> so guys, I will see you next week. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, do all that fun stuff. And I'll see you in the next one. Keep smiling.